Voyager 1 and 2, NASA's longest-running missions, have detected a searingly hot region of space where the sun's influence ends. Wall of fire. What exactly is it? It's a boundary zone at the edge of the heliosphere. That's the bubble created by the solar wind, where temperatures spike to between 30,000 and 50,000 Kelvin. How did the probe survive passing through it? While the plasma particles are moving at extremely high velocities, creating that high temperature, the particle density is incredibly low low. It's basically a near vacuum, so there aren't enough particles hitting the spacecraft to transfer significant heat. So what does this discovery tell us? It's revising our understanding of how our solar system interacts with the wider galaxy. But the temperature spike wasn't the only surprise. Really? How so? Scientists found that the magnetic field lines just inside the heliosphere aligned with those in interstellar space just outside of it. They also discovered a leakage of particles through this boundary, suggesting the heliosphere isn't a perfect shield against galactic cosmic rays. So our solar system's protective bubble is more permeable than we thought.